a little bit about reframing today. How do you reframe your thinking to be more helpful and useful? So I'm trying to refrain from using the word negative and positive because I'm not a big fan of positive thinking, uh, mainly because I find that many people mis misunderstand and think of it as pushing away the negative thoughts and wanting to change it to something positive. But what if we can reframe our thinking so that um, it comes into this space where it is bigger and more expanded, where there is more possibilities and more neutral versus self-judgmental. So I'm going to approach this from certain common thoughts that we have about our mind. A lot of times when we start to worry, um, isn't, when we start to ruminate and worry too much, the thing that we like to tell ourselves is, I want to stop thinking now. Why can't this mind stop thinking? Stop thinking now. And instead, try telling yourself this. I notice my thoughts. Fact, there are a lot of thoughts. Another fact and observation, neutral. And to say this to yourself, the nature of my mind is to think. Because that's also a fact. The nature of my mind is to think. Take a breath with that. I don't need to stop it. Maybe how can I begin to hold that gently? It's just a question. You don't need to have answers right away. Instead of the question of how can I stop thinking? How can I stop this mind? And notice that shift when you, when you tell yourself some facts and observation. There is a lot of thinking right now. The nature of my mind is to think. How can I hold that gently in this moment and breathe with that? Another example, like a lot of people usually ask for clarity, like they want to be clear or certain about something. Because sometimes we f when we feel confused and we feel uncertain, we don't know what, what step to take next. And then the feelings of being lost and that problem is not settled. So when you find yourself in that kind of state, right, that when you're telling us like, I want an answer, I want to have clarity now. So instead, maybe ask yourself, or just stating that state for yourself. I am feeling confused right now. There is the emotion of confusion. The mind again has a lot of thoughts, trying to come up with the answer. Mm. It's not working. Again, always breathing. And now you could ask this instead. Now, what does clarity look like or feel like when answers aren't immediately available? What does clarity look like or feel like when answers aren't immediately available? And then kind of just sit with that that kind of questions, that sense of allowing yourself to be in confusion for a while. Like I don't have an answer. Now I'm allowing myself to just sit with that uncertainty for a while. Because it is sometimes needed for us to have that little bit of spaciousness, a bit of pausing, a bit of allowing. Because a mind that is very tight and clenched, it's unlikely to come up with any answers anyway. The likelihood of having more clarity and answers is when we can loosen the mind more, make it more spacious, hold it more lightly.
Hope that helps.